Hi, it's Egon. Uh, so, thank you for coming into Appster today. No uh, you and I spoke, I think, initially last year in about June or July. July, yeah. July, um, you came to us with an idea, um, which I believe has now been launched. Is that yes, correct? Yes, mate. It's been a week now. Yeah, been a week. Yeah. Excellent. And for anyone at home, it's called Notice Board. Yes. Uh, did you want to maybe briefly explain what your application does? Yeah, it's uh, based on the concept of a traditional notice board that we all have seen growing up. Yeah, just uh, so community notice board, that many categories on there. Uh, ours was just clustered at home, heaps of sheets, uh, sheets falling off, people you know fighting for space. So yeah, and um, got in contact with you guys, and uh, we went through the scope, and now it's on an iPhone app. Yeah, yeah. excellent. So that's been a long time in the making. Um, and you've worked with many of us throughout that phase. Did you want to maybe talk about your experience with Appster and how you feel we've been? Well, as a uh, first time trying to get an app developed, it was scary. I uh, didn't know who to trust. As you hear so many stories, you know, about uh, shams and stuff. But uh, hearing you guys on the radio with Hamish and Andy, I uh, got in contact with you that way. And then you were able to get a team ready for me and I worked with that team and we went through the scope, the function scope and um, just as a first time user it was just good to have people get in contact with you, let you know the progress and then when I was uh, given the project manager, Shelley, things went yeah, great in the development side of things and yeah. just. Yeah, sure. I guess as an app development company, apps is really big on being transparent and collaborative throughout that development process and making sure you understand where you are at every step of the way. How do you feel that experience was from you working with Shelley as your project manager? Working with Shelley was great. Yeah, week in, week out, um, any time of the day. If I had a question, I had a lot of questions. Yeah. And uh, Shelley was able to, as soon as yeah, she saw the email, she was able to help me out. Uh, the team worked well with Shelley and um, yeah, they got things going and uh, getting pictures of the development stages and test flight, test flight was unreal, so yeah, yeah it, all, it helped man. it was great. Yeah, yeah cool, so um, just for those perhaps watching test flight, um, is that the, when you were getting the build on your device? That yeah, you could actually like see? the prototype stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah so, that would have been exciting. Um, yeah, just little steps and I was able to show friends and uh, let them know and let them in because I was uh, doing my progress side of things on Facebook, yeah. and uh, yeah, people were getting getting the anticipation kind of thing. Yeah, I yeah. I've been on people. your Facebook page. It's yeah, great. Thanks, you check yeah. it out. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, um, so I guess that would have also been um, comforting and gave you some confidence about what was happening in the progress throughout the development by that engagement with Shelley. Yeah. Well, if I didn't hear from Shelley within a week, I was getting worried. So, yeah. um, to Shelley to get in contact with me and. Uh, was able to show me stuff and like like I said, the picture says a thousand words, so being able to see that progress, yeah, yeah. that was great. Yeah, excellent. So um, I guess then for anyone that's maybe choosing a developer or wanting to develop an application who may be a little bit like yourself and have some initial reservations or feel a little bit, um, yeah, just nervous about the whole process because let's face it, you know, it's, uh, there's, it's always a risk and there's a gamble to it. Yeah. Um, what would you say to them when choosing a developer? Um, and you know, would you recommend apps to, to other yeah, people out there? Yes, I would. Uh, it's out there, you just don't know. When you look at for other countries trying to get as cheap as possible, you don't know if they're leading you on kind of thing. So to find an Australian company with people working here in Australia, yeah. it was a relief. Yeah. And uh, to know uh, as well that you used um, Hamish and Andy, like Hamish and Andy used Appster. Yeah. Uh, they're a reliable source. Yeah, yeah. yeah. As much as their characters are reliable. Yeah, yeah. So to get in contact with you guys, you guys rung me up. I think I gave an idea once and you rung me up and actually uh, dismissed it. You said, oh, it's too expensive. And I went, well, how many companies do that? You know, yeah. like most people go, yeah, give us all your money. But Abster, no, you dismissed it. I come up with a second idea and um, you rung me up within four hours and you're on board. And yeah. uh, you had the team ready and everything. So yeah, yeah. it was great. It was I remember a, a that relief. initial discussion. Because yes. I do like the traditional notice board. Yes. I also like digital. Yeah. So I like the fact that you were incorporating the two. Um, so yeah, if anyone's got a notice board out there, go and pin yeah. up a promo for notice Save board. Save you heaps of money, Dion. just get the free download one. <laughs> yeah, might as well utilize any time as a sales pitch, yeah. I say. <laughs> um, so, Dion, we're really excited to have um, worked with you. We wish you all the success. Um, 
I believe that you've been out there on foot yes. building up some momentum around your application. Um, we would encourage anyone that's watching this to download it, you know, give it a go. Um, but yeah, all the best. Good luck from thank us. Much, yeah. So much for, um, thank you again for coming down all the way from Queensland. Yes. Um, good place for me. <laughs> and um, we look forward to working with you in the future. So um, we will be looking at bringing it out on the Android platform soon. Yes. Thank you. Thank, thank you, everyone. Stay tuned.